Hello! Today we shall be covering some of the new features on Hinton and Fairchild's Big Room Kicks 1.2. Some of the new features included are as follows. You can export the sound by right-clicking on the record button down here, then right-clicking on the highlighted drum pad until the sound is stopped. This will automatically open up a saved dialog box. You can rename the sample or keep the given randomly generated name. The new and improved distortion. This includes eight types of wave shape distortion, a three band equalizer, an amount, and a wet and dry mix. You can also normalize and bit crush the signal down here. One of the biggest new features on Big Room Kicks 1.2 is the user pitch envelopes. You can edit your envelopes by clicking the E button down here. You can add points by right-clicking and delete points by hovering over, right-clicking, and selecting delete. Then, save your own user-made envelope and load them back up for later use. On the body section, we have added a new knob called the Air. This is essentially a noise oscillator, which provides more flexibility in the creation of a body sound. We also have swapped one of the two distortions for a bit crusher. There is now an overall control for the attack, decay, and sustain envelope too. Some of the hidden features now. MIDI Learn Control. By hovering over a control, double right clicking to set it to receive data, then moving the knot on your MIDI controller. If you would like to reset this, you simply double left click on the control. You can get finer adjustments from holding shift down on your keyboard and moving a control. Please visit us at www.hintonandfairchild.co.uk